Child care is a necessity for working parents, but it's an expensive one, and a new study shows parents aren't the only ones paying. Economists believe that the state's businesses could be losing millions when child care issues keep parents at home. Elizabeth Bowell has a look. Yeah. This quiet moment alone is rare for Allison and Earl Kegler. Both Allison and her husband work full time, and with two young boys at home, coordinating child care dominates their schedules. It's hard. Um, sometimes I, I have to work late, and daycare closes at six, and um, sometimes I can't get out. And their pocketbooks. We were thinking about having another, uh, another child, we're trying to add, add to the family. And yep. One of the big things she kept saying is, well, how are we going to afford another kid in daycare? According to a new study from LSU and Partners, nearly 20% of the Louisiana workforce are parents with young kids, meaning child care is a necessity, costing parents an average of $5,600 a year. It's definitely a big demand, especially whenever um, I do find we have a lot of single parents. And um, I mean, they can't work and keep their children. The study also claims a lack of child care and early education options are costing businesses big. Researchers surveyed working parents across the state and found that 40% had recently missed work due to child care issues. One in six said they had to quit their job, and one in 13 said they'd been fired. Economists with the study believe that turnover alone cost employers $816 million a year. And as a result of that, employers, businesses have to invest dollars in training and hiring new workers. And so these are not trivial costs to employers. The study's authors also believe lawmakers could help by putting more money into the state's child care assistance program, which helps provide quality child care for low-income working families. The program has been slashed nearly 70 percent over the last decade. But with the current budget issues, researchers say that option isn't likely. Elizabeth Vowell, WAFB 9 News. The study also estimates the state loses about $84 million in tax revenue when parents can't work due to child care problems.